attesi qua stasera stiamo parlando del match valevole per il Rising Sun Taito e non è finita qua perché infatti se avete aggiunto la vista il titolo si trova qua sopra perché infatti sarà un ladder match un match con le scale infatti per poter vincere o mantenere la cintura bisognerà prenderla dalla sopra attraverso l'utilizzo di una scala ma ora introduciamo lo sfidante un astro nascente del wrestling britannico Asfita Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Armenio San Bartolomeo for the showdown of the sun. I am the emissary of truth, TJ Lee, alongside my co-partner as always, the mastermind, Ollie Spring. And Ollie, we have a man we are very well familiar with, the face of Sacrifice Pro Wrestling, coming out to the ring now, Ashley Dunn. Of course, Ashley Dunn, a guy that we both know very well, making the trip across the, uh, the continent. On a it's an beautiful day in Italy. Without a doubt, absolute pleasure to be here. And uh, he's just Rick rolled everyone. <laughs> That's um, I was not expecting. I was expecting his normal entrance music. I was not anticipating a Rick roll. Uh, so Ashley Dunn won the opportunity to face either the God of Sun champion or the Rising Sun champion at the last show. He chose the Rising Sun champ, who we're going to see momentarily. Um, and he chose to make it a ladder match, Ollie. Now, what do you think his mindset is going into that? Well, you know what? I say Ashley Dunn is a smart guy. He's a high flyer. He's got... I mean, he's a man that can do it all, really. Um, I mean, we've seen him in ladder matches before. Uh, it's, it's kind of his forte in many ways. You know, this guy, he's innovative. You, know, you give him a weapon, he's going to find something new to do with it. A new way to hurt you with it. Uh, put him in a ladder match here. Um, and as I tell you what, anything can happen right now, Siege. Never seen a man so happy to have Rick, uh, Rick Astley. He's never going to give you up as a steam song. I love this man. Uh, fantastic. Yeah, he's, um, he's an unpredictable guy and he has the it factor. He's been doing this since the backyard wrestling days with the likes of Will Ospreay and Kip Sabian. He has made his own way here. He has made his own career what it is and I think he's done a very good job of doing that without that I mean I've seen the footage so I know exactly where Ashley Dunn is coming from Pensate a solamente 17 anni del già campione il nostro il Rising Sun Champion Akira could not have put it better myself and Akira is the staple champion here not a man to sleep on. Now, we, uh, we haven't seen much of this young man. As is, uh, you know, we've seen a couple of uh, different matches from Rising Sun. Very, very high on the product. They do a really, really good job here. Um, but this is going to be a really interesting test for Ashley Dunn, taking on what is the face of this promotion. I said the face of the Rising Sun versus the face of Sacrifice. This one could get out of control, folks. So hold on to your seats. It's going to be a wild one. Now, in our experience, Ollie, ladder matches, they tend to... <laughs> they tend to not have uh, everyone walking out okay afterwards. And obviously, it's for the Rising Sun Championship. So stakes are high. Stakes high. The belt is, is, is high right now, T. You know, like you say, ladder matches. It's really a case of who wants it more, who's willing mm -hmm. to give it all to win the belt. Absolutely. And here we go. Bell rang. And uh, referee stepping outside wisely, knowing that he is only there to count the pinfall or submission. Uh, or to note, uh, excuse me, to note when he gets the championship belt there. So I'm a bit overwhelmed by uh, seeing a, such a unique looking ring. A huge ring. Beautiful. Jet, jet lag is a wonderful thing, Yeah, Peach. it really is. Really is. So referee going to be watching for whoever can grab that belt first. But uh, I think we've got a long way before either one of them is going to go up that ladder because they've got to wear their opponent down, Ollie. I think timing is key in these ladder matches. I mean, you try and grab that ladder too early, you're going to introduce a weapon into the ring while your opponent is primed and ready. Leave it too late. I mean, you're going to be you're going to be far too beaten down to climb the ladder yourself. Beautiful slam down there, and uh, Ashley immediately going for a wrestling clinic. 
getting a good hold on Akira's neck and Akira saying no I'm not having any of that but these two men are going to start feeding each other out very early on and see which one of them is capable of out wrestling the other and, and a beautiful kip up there that's the thing when you take two competitors that aren't used to each other I mean we've called we've called countless Ashley done matches uh, I mean yeah we've seen him go to war with the likes of El Jeff uh, and with the likes of Jay Garner countless times so you know in, in those situations they know exactly what they're going to get right now Ashley Dunn and Akira just feel like you say feeling each other out trying to gauge what sort of a match they're in for Absolutely. right now Absolutely. and uh, both of these young men uh, in the, uh, just hitting their primes now small men in their divisions but that means they can jump up they can get around much easier and both of them now bringing in the great equalizer in a ladder rally. Now, what does this mean, bring it in this early into the match? Well, like I said, right now, you are introducing two weapons that can cause unimaginable amount of pain. I mean, the, the damage you can do with a ladder, Ooh. it just doesn't, it doesn't beg thinking about. And I mean, immediately, Nate, the shock absorption on the hands there, very nasty, and actually, don't go with a stiff right there, and Acura going with one of his own. And you can hear them. These these two are not pulling any punches. It all for this Rising Sun Championship. Sakira firing the, the back hometown with those kid here, Yeah. Oh, but Ashley Dunn saying none of that. You know, Ashley Dunn being uh, from the same town as we are, Teej. Absolutely. We're, we're not used to seeing him not have that home field advantage. No, that's the thing. No matter whether you love Ashley Dunn or hate him, you will respect him. He's part of the Milton Keynes, uh, the Milton Keynes Massive, as we call ourselves. And you can uh, you can catch him in the UK at Sacrifice Pro Wrestling. Tell uh, me you didn't just say Milton Keynes Massive. I did say the Milton Keynes <laughs> Massive. I'm a little bit younger than you. I'm in mean, Ashley's age demographic. This is the MK Massive is what we went with. But uh, you can see Ashley Dunn and many other amazing UK competitors at Hope Wrestling in Mansfield, um, and in Derby, and at Sacrifice Pro Wrestling in Leighton Buzzard. Um, but right now, we are in the heart of Italy. A beautiful, beautiful match unfolding here. And you've got an entourage at the side, the entire locker room there for, uh, for Rising Sun rallying to Akira, not wanting the championship to go to someone outside of the country. Oh, look, it's Akira Ooh. up and down with a drop. He actually done, did not see that coming. And going for a nice snap there. there. Oh, like a crack of a whip. And they heard that. I think they heard that back in Milton Keynes. Yeah, well, I wouldn't doubt that. I think Shogun J just got shivers down his spine after feeling that kind of kick. Well, look at Ashley Dunn just hooking the leg. Not wanting Akira hits to get ahead of steam right now. But you know what? I get the feeling that Ashley Dunn needs to be careful. Oh! oh, leading him in. Making him play possum. And out he goes to focus on that title. And just see the cogs turning in Ashley Dunn's head right now. I have no idea what he's planning, but I bet it's going to be painful if your name is Akira. I think if your name is anyone, oh. the steps in the room actually done. But yeah, Akira knowing he can't give him too much breathing space, too much opportunity. Really starting to capitalize here, Ollie. Wait and a second, Akira's off the right. Oh. He's going to fly. Oh my goodness. Suicide dive through the middle rope. Always a dangerous maneuver. See many, many young men and women not uh, executed uh, properly. And yet Akira did that masterfully there. You know, most of the time you see people dive through the ropes going underneath the top rope. Uh, Akira there choosing to dive under the middle rope just going for that extra burst of speed hitting Ashley Dunn with just that little bit more force yeah like a little torpedo I mean Ashley Dunn feeling that probably a good thing that the uh, the Italian crowd can't understand the words he's saying right now I don't think some of the kids would be happy Akira like a man on a mission here. Oh, it's the knife edge chop straight to the heart of the superstar. Ashley Dunn and a second one to boot. Making his presence very well known here. Oh, ah, turnabout's fair play. Ashley Dunn saying, anything you can do, I can do better. And the crowd actually getting behind Ashley Dunn. Of course, the, uh, the Italian fans just appreciate sportsmanship. 
And you know, there's a, there is a lot to respect about Ashley Dunn. As there is Akira. Well, that's what I've always said, is that you may not like Ashley Dunn. You may hate Ashley Dunn, but you will respect Ashley Dunn for what he does in that ring. It is no surprise that Ashley's old teammates, friends, and backyard wrestling competitors have gone on to amazing things. Let's not forget Kip Sabian, the Kings of Flight champion. Will Ospreay, the best of the Super Juniors champion. Everyone in Ashley Dunn's old circle oh. has gone to greatness, including him. And there's reasons for that. And that headbutt is a prime example of how he does it. Oh, but look at this. Akira running up the ladder. Oh, oh Hurricane Rana off that ladder through Ashley Dunn and teach both men down on the ground at ringside right now. I mean, it goes to show this is exactly how much that championship means to both men. One man went to add another one to his trophy case. That's actually done. And Akira wanted to keep it in the home country where it belongs. And the crowd's saying this is awesome. And, and how, could they, how could they not? It's such an incredible match they're seeing right now. Beautiful ladder match. We said from the outset, Tej, that the, the, the man that's going to walk away the champion is the one that's going to give it all, both in and outside of the ring. And right now, Akira is looking like the firm favourite to climb that ladder and retrieve that championship belt. And here he goes, Akira going up. Right of his country behind him, and Ashley Dunn says no. As I say, you can just see the, 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 the scars of battle already slowing down Akira trying to climb that ladder. And you see it on many shirts, Ollie, but Ashley Dunn has a phrase it's get on your knees and receive a shining wizard. Makes you wonder how long it's going to be before he makes Akira feel that thought on the side of his head. And right now, he has got bad intentions in mind. And he stopped himself there. Put on the brakes. So oh, Ashley Dunn put on the brakes as well. The wily oh. veteran knowing all the moves of playing possum. Nasty roaring elbow there. Oh, just a knee. And now four arms Akira from Akira. just going insane here. But not enough to put Ashley Dunn away. Oh, my goodness. You cannot sleep on Ashley Dunning. He is dangerous at all times, even more so when he's damaged. Akira just going stern and first into that ladder. Taking the full force of that metal right into his body. And so, no surprises, Ashley Dunn back up on his feet. And now Ashley Dunn looking like he could Way be. To finish what he started Ollie. that's it actually don't look in the, the freshest of these two warriors right now oh there's life in akira might be younger might be less experienced but he does not want to go out that fight and now Ashley Dunn, lying prone across that ladder. I have no idea what Akira's got in mind right now. If you're Ashley Dunn, you want to get the hell out of Dodge right now. Not going to happen if he doesn't move in the next couple seconds. That's going to be a nasty, angry Italian man raining down on you with okay. no cushion. But the ladder. Oh, double oh. foot stomp onto Ashley Dunn, onto that ladder. Folks, there is absolutely no giving those steel rungs. That was the full weight of Akira coming down on Ashley Dunn's chest. Double foot stomp and Ashley Dunn must be in an immense, immense amount of pain We've right now. We've seen him in many different spots before and if there's one thing we know about him, he's always dangerous. And again, Akira and just making a up. slow climb. Painstakingly slow, and Ashley Dunn just had the, just enough time to recover. Oh, 
Now they've got two ladders up just to add an extra leverage to make sure they don't tip over. Smart. Well, both men meeting at the middle at the top. Just palm strikes back and forth between both men. Wailing They're on each not other. Not willing to give up an inch. And the Rising Sun fans here right now showing their appreciation for both men. Beating the absolute hell out of each other. All for that championship. And, and he's saying, come at me, give me everything. Just strikes back and forth, left and right. Oh, oh nasty knee. Nasty four on a follow-up, that beautiful combination. He's got to capitalize. Ashley Dunn's fading, but he is not out yet. And that's what I'm talking about. Look oh, at the strikes. Quick flurry from the superstar. Ashley Dunn, back fist to boot. Making Papa Meltzer proud right now with the kind of work he's putting in. See, that's the difference between the two of them, Ollie, is that Ashley Dunn is able to capitalize when he has something like this. He's pushing him off. Oh, that's oh. the kick. Akira rolls him up. He's not quick enough, though. He's time to get up. Finishes like a man. Oh, wait Ooh, a second. Rewind Rana. Rana. Oh, my goodness. Ashley Dunn spiked on his head. Yeesh. He's going to need to be in a very special class on the way home. Protect that neck, because I don't know if he's getting back up. Akira, uh, this is your chance. Set that ladder up and climb as fast as you can. Crowd absolutely loving this as well, and quite rightly so. The longer this match has gone on, the more people have gone around the ring. That's how much they love this. And Akira finally back to his feet after what seems like an absolute eternity. In that ring, time slows down, especially for a match like this. And just look at this. Both men just, just dragging their lifeless bodies up this ladder. Both of them absolutely spent from this absolute war. Exactly. Who can give more? Who's got a little bit more left in the tank? Ashley Dunn now on the floor. Now Akira, he, he took down Chris Tyler uh, at the show before to, to retain this oh, wait title. A second, this is wait his a first second. defense, but Ashley Dunn's a new beast entirely, and Akira's got to show why he's that good. Oh, oh, here oh we go. he's going we're for going it. To the underhook destroyer. No, wait a second. No. Reversal. Oh. Reversal. Turn of Akira. Break yeah. Canadian destroyer. Wow. Ashley Dunn spiked on his head from a destroyer oh from my Akira. God. 10th of June 2017 in Bergamo in Italy. Mark that day down. Ashley Dunn may have just seen his last match. Wow. Ashley Dunn looking to hit that signature double underhook destroyer. Akira <laughs> reversing out of it. I don't think I've ever seen that team. Nope. That's why I said to mark the day down. That is... Ashley Dunn's never going to forget that day. But this is what propelled Akira to victory in his last match against Chris Tyler. A, a man you don't sleep on. One of the best in the UK, as is Ashley Dunn. So now the question is, what can Ashley Dunn pull out of his uh, bag of tricks and stop Akira from making that, that ascent to the title? And he's just kicking away saying, you got nothing. Well, I hate to say it, Tej, but I think Ashley Dunn is done in this match no pun intended every pun intended he is absolutely finished right now there's no way he's going to be able to recover from that he's to climbing. win this match the spirit of competition is too strong and he's been caught oh oh wait a oh, second the tree of woe 
Oh, Hang up no. in that ladder. Akira can't move. He's trapped. Oh, Siege. is this it? Wait a second. Ashley Dunn is somehow at the top oh. of this ladder. Akira just cannot move. He's got his feet hooked. Sitting down as well. He knows this is it. He knows. Oh, oh. second down. First down. Oh, my goodness. Jesus. Akira is dead. Legs to the neck. And Ashley Dunn takes the championship back to the UK. Ashley Dunn has done it. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new Rising Sun champion, and his name is Ashley Dunn. What an immense, immense match that was. Sees both men leaving it all in the ring. Forearms, kicks, chops, palm strikes. Absolutely everything they could throw at each other, they did. War was held in that ring today. And we found the victor, and to the victor go the spoils. Wow. There is a reason this young man, at 27 years old, is in the conversation as one of the best UK wrestlers. And he's just proven it again. And you know what, he's just proven it to Italy right now, Tej. But take nothing away from Akira. A man, oh, and Ashley Dunn's not done with him. Ah, oh, that's good. Some sportsmanship there. Akira held that title for a while and took on all comers. But it just wasn't his night. But what a man. What a young man. Bigger and better things for him. But this is Ashley Dunn's night. And he more than earned it. 